Good evening, everybody. My name is Peter. My name is Sarah. We are the Bucket the List Fit family. The Bucket List family. <laughs> the Brookhart Project. The Brookhart Project. We're coming to pick up our old, our old pal Meg. Our old pal Megaroo. I don't think Megaroo's ever been in a vlog. No. We'll have to make she sure she hasn't. wants to be in one. I think she will be. She'll be okay with it. We'll I think we're doing. Go and see them. Disney Springs tonight, though? Yes, I believe she wants some Earl of Sandwich. Megan, like, came on our family vacation with us in 2012. We've She came and visited us while we were here on the college program. She, like, she's literally, like, our wedding day was there helping out. So she's, like, a so very, much. a very good friend. She's... So leave a comment down below and say thanks for being awesome, Meg. <laughs> but we're just waiting for her in the parking lot, and... I think we're by a college program, housing like by Vista Way, so any old CPs. I think we're by Vista Way right now. Because I think knows? Vista Way was on the other side of 535 from Patterson and Chatham. I felt like I was farther, but I was also young and not aware of my surroundings. And the only thing we had to worry about was making nachos <laughs> and getting to work on time. Guys, we're at our old sandwich. It actually wasn't crazy busy because we've been seeing online that the theme parks are like the worst thing ever right now with crowds. Sarah, you said you saw the Big Thunder Mountain was like past the bridge. But we got, we found our friend. Hi! It's Meg! She got some new sandwich. Chicken, what's on it? Chicken, bacon, cheddar, uh, sriracha ranch sauce, and then there's supposed to be Pico de Gallo, but I'm not a salsa kind of girl. And Sarah might steal it because she loves sriracha aioli. Flashback to yesterday's vlog. I don't, I'm really mad at Megan for not getting a holiday sandwich, but I admire her for venturing out of the comfort zone. I really, we're, we just left uh, the Christmas store and we're now in the t-shirt store, right next to the Art of Disney, and I really want this. This is what, what Ben and, and Carolyn got us, and I loved it. I started reading it and I didn't realize it as the search of lost Disney cartoons, because it's like, there's a whole series of Oswald that they had to like, they were trying to find the physical film of when they got the rights back in 2006. But this is a bunch of old maps of Disney parks, and I love it. I also wanted to point out today that we had to go to the Christmas store, and I didn't film any of it, but I'm sure many of you have seen it. If not, we'll go there again. But I've been on a Christmas kick today, so I needed to go in there, feel like I'm gonna pull out some Christmas candles later. This morning, on the way to and from work, I had Christmas Pandora on, so I was just kind of checking out the Christmas lights. I'm ready for Christmas. I think I do it with Halloween Horror Nights announcing. Don't know why Halloween Horror Nights is making me think of Christmas. So they're so close, maybe. But I'm ready for Christmas. What do you think of your first ganache? We heard that she's she's never had the ganachery, so we had to bring her in. It was good. It was raspberry? It looks raspberry now yeah, that I see the color. We just got a cookie this sandwich. Is all Megan's fault. She's a bad influence. <laughs> so she's on vacation. So we got a cannoli cookie ice cream sandwich. It's only $7.50. Usually the cookies are $5 each, plus there's cannoli gelato between them. I don't really know how it was $7.50. I'm gonna take this ridiculous bite because of how melty the gelato is. Oh that. god. Uh, we're kind of struggling with this gelato ice cream. Megan, on the other hand, went with a delicate cone, very user friendly. There's literally a puddle of gelato in there. But it's tasty, right? Guys, this right here is Vista Way, the first 
Disney College Program housing. This is where we registered to get our keys to our apartment. This is where we met Megan Chelsea. Megan is staying right over here, so we dropped her off and we're like, holy smokes. I'm like, that's Mr. Way. This is where I met Chelsea for the very this first where we're time. At my roommate, Trevor. We actually met a bunch of our roommates there, right? No, I only met Trevor. Yeah. You met all your roommates, because yeah. you knew who they were. And then we went from here to Patterson Court mm -hmm. and actually so. went to our apartment. So this is where like you parked in that parking lot in our with our old Grand Cherokee. Oh, flashbacks. Flashbacks. These are probably CPs. Look this, at is this. My, this is my poking owner. <laughs> I'm gonna link in the corner our like introductory video of she's when we so got little. you. She looks so goofy. She's comfy. She's falling asleep right now. Oh. She's the sweetest. All right, we're home and it's only a little bit after midnight. Wow. So we're gonna try to go to bed and get some normal-esque sleep. Um, Oh, we added tank tops to the shop yesterday. We forgot to mention it. We, it was kind of goofy because it is hot in Florida and people want to wear them on vacation. So we added a women's cut and then a unisex option for tank tops. What should we do tonight when you're watching this? We don't have plans yet. We're not gonna see Megan again until Thursday. Mm -hmm. We don't have plans yet. And the parks are kind of crazy, but they're open late, so it's nice. Yeah. I'm kind of feeling Animal Kingdom, but I'm not sure yet. We also haven't done a resort in a while. Yeah. Let us know if you have anything you want to see or any ideas for us in the downtown Orlando area. Wow. Our fridge got fixed. I don't know if we told you guys, but... Fridge? Our fridge. Oh. Um, at the... I don't know if we told you about two things. Out of all the hecticness, hecticness of this weekend... With the pest control. And the bees and everything, our washer went kaput. And our it didn't totally go quick, it just won't drain fully, so... It's not working. No. And then our freezer automatic, like, wa ice maker... Um, was spurting water was out, spurting water the out of the back, if you ever turned it on. So we just had to keep the ice maker <laughs> off. So That's we had spraying three water. So we had, like, pest orders. control, bees, washer, freezer... And it's like, this apartment complex is amazing. Yeah. And they've been great, and the amenities are amazing. Been here eight months, nothing but amazing. Even during the hurricane, like A plus. Yeah, and we've even had a new a washer put in. We've had other like work orders. And it's the been like toilet, twenty minutes, like come. brand new, fixed right away. But like this weekend, it's just like everything at once. So the fridge is fixed, the bees are fixed. We just need our washer fixed. Yeah. And we'll finally like. We can't even put our stuff back in our cabinets just to make, because we have to make sure that nothing comes back. Right, the people, the, the pest control is going to come back seven days after the big treatment to make sure everything still looked good in the whole building. Yeah. Um, so. And then we're good to put all our stuff back because we're still like living out of like, I need a cup of coffee. Let me walk over to my second bedroom, go underneath the tarp from the bees and find a cup of a mug. I've taken most of the tarps up now. Yeah. But, but Eve's giving us that look like... Guys, come on, humans. You guys do this with the camera, then we go to sleep. Let's go to sleep. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. You guys rock. Oh, we didn't tell you about the cookie sandwich. It was so messy, so rich. Don't do it. We have belly aches. That, but like the gelato melted right away. Yeah. The two so we thought it was a deal, but it was like two cookies in like milk slop, but like not even full milk because it's gelato. So it was like just. Weird dairy. Still tasted good, but like yeah, it was not it was what lot. you wanted it, a, a gelato sandwich to be. It's good to be home. <laughs> we know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.